Ladoski floor to Daria Reshkova, distinguished uh, chairpers, distinguished colleagues. My presentation is about cardiac tumor. Uh, cardiac tumors are extremely a rare pathology. We often have uh, benign rather than malignant tumors, and um, from malignant tumors, we have the uh, metastasis in 25 cases. Angiosarcoma is a quite uh, widespread the image here. Clinical picture is uh, determined by tumor localization, its size, its uh, deep invasion, and embolic complications. The clinical picture shows through the uh, heart failure, the uh, rhythm and conductility damages, the uh, side uh, the heart disease problems and the localization of distant metastases. Currently, we have different methods of anatomic visualizations. Among those are hybrid technologies that um, gives us the idea not just about the pathology but about the symbolic status. But the first place and the main way to verify the um, a heart tumor is the uh, histological material, which is uh, do, um, which is not easy to access, and sometimes standard biopsy does not produce positive results. Negative uh, uh, signs of malignant uh, tumors include ratios between specificity and sensitivity is the hyperbolism glucose. The purpose of my presentation is to represent CT opportunities for heart tumors. The first case is 15-year-old boy. He was found the uh, lesion in the right In the right oracle, uh, that was confirmed by CTMRI, and uh, the uh, malignant nature of this tumor was also confirmed. We also had the PET uh, uh, CT. Uh, you can see the uh, big lesion in the right oracle histological study identified the angiosarcoma besides the lesion of accumulation in liver was uh, extremely high with accumulation of tracers and multiple lesions in lungs that were interpreted by us like metastasis, but we were not sure. According to the autopsy data that was identified, this lesion accumulated uh, tracers. It turned out to be microinflammation, and smaller lesions turned out to be embolial lesions. So CT did not allow us to differentiate this process. That's the patient with non-differentiated pleomorphic sarcoma. Pleomorphic sarcoma. Uh, she uh, had the acute coronary syndrome, and doctor saw the lesion in her heart with express biopsy. They stayed a sarcoma instead of myxoma that was suspected before the surgery. The patient was sent to oncology hospital. Uh, has been followed out for a year, and in a year she has some neurological concerns. The brain CT shows the uh, lesion. She had the, the surgery in parietal lobe, and it turned out that was the metastasis. But you mean? Uh, 
found another metastasis in the brain and uh, there was also the local regression found in the place of surgery. It's good to know that at the PET CT test there, there was no fixation in the brain area. And a couple of more cases about the benign lesions at the uh, right atrium, myxoma, the absence of tracer accumulation. We can see the photopanic um, area here. So PET-CT helps us to identify um, the uh, malignant and benign tumors, but it's not the uh, method of choice for metastasis identification. I want to thank my colleagues for illustration. And I want to